Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. This is so far and today we're gonna have another unpack video. And um, it's quite interesting because I got two large boxes here. Uh, well, uh, part I'll say it like that. One is this and one of that. Kind of heavy. And I'm probably gonna start with this one here. So uh, I'm gonna get my knife and just gonna unpack it. So give me one second. Uh, I need to be careful. Yeah, uh, always be careful with knives, especially sharp ones. Yeah, I can cut yourself. Uh, we don't. We would like to avoid that. Now here we go. What we got here is something very interesting. Now I think that's it. Yep, that's it. So I'm gonna take this away. Now this is pretty cool and awesome. <clears throat> um, this is like a, a document giving to a uh, veteran. Uh, for the anniversary of the Great Patriotic War or Second World War and another one it's like something like 30 years victory uh, during the war, Great Patriotic War 41 to 45 May 1975 and what we got here is uh, what you can see is um, it's the comrade uh, Habukova a fe female soldier um, from the first city hospital okay this is like she was like a medic or something like that that's pretty cool it was giving uh, to all veterans that's um this is like a old union um id or workers union id um the basic information such as when she was born in 1919 uh when did she enter the union in 1935 and it's actually written in russian and in ukrainian so she paid actually um, her um, fees, monthly fees. Pretty interesting. So you can see here. Nice idea. Also belong all to one person. Now this is pretty cool. Um, there are some documents in it. Okay. Um, this is actually her working book. So this is like kind of like keeping a record of uh, where she was working and so on. So it's quite interesting that uh, in 1937. And this kind of docs are very interesting because you can see that she actually uh, joined uh, the uh, Red Army or the so Soviet Army and uh, worked there as an, um, seems like a medic, yeah, like a medic. And all the way through, so she kind of like worked, worked the way through it. And uh, the, uh, what else do we have here? Some documents. Okay, um, that's a document for the hospital. Very interesting. I will uh, do a review on them or um, post some pictures of it with the translation on my Instagram. Uh, also, yeah, some information about that she was like uh, working for the hospital. It seems like 1948. Okay. What else is this? Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. And some photographs. Now this, these ones are wartime photographs, so as you can see, very interesting, nothing on the back side. That's her, probably during, this is during the war, that might be after the war, interesting. And now let's take a look at this big one. Now this is pretty interesting because, oh, okay, I see, oh, that's interesting, I will take a look at this in one moment. Uh, so we have here uh, some also cards, congratulation cards to the 45th anniversary of giving to vets. That's very interesting. Uh, what's this? The administration of the hospital congratulates her to the 70th anniversary of her B day. That's pretty interesting. <laughs> nice. And. Uh, here, I'm just gonna put this to the side. Okay, here we go. Now this is pretty interesting, it's the same. So first hospital, city hospital, congratulates her uh, to the 40, 40th uh, anniversary or 40th anniversary of the Great Patriotic War. And then there's this one. This is pretty interesting because it's giving to her, to her uh, 65th year's anniversary and um, continuously work at the hospital so this is kind of like a very interesting piece and the best one is 
dead, it's a colored photograph of her. And if you take a look, it's exactly the same picture or photograph, see? That's pretty cool, love that. Yeah, she was definitely a medic during the war, so it uh, will be interesting to research her. Now, this is the first thing, so I'm just gonna put this on the side. So, as you have seen, a friend of mine, who's actually sent me this, uh, well, a friend and a uh, fellow collector, gave me this. Now, this is something very interesting, I did not know about that. Seems to be like, uh, it was like a, like, oh my god. This is way too cool. Take a look at the date, March 53. And it says actually when Stalin died. So this is the newspaper Pulse, which was released on uh, 9th May, uh, 9th March, sorry, sorry, 1953. And it was confirming Stalin's death. Wow. Now this is something very interesting. Very interesting. On the 5th of March, at nine o'clock, uh, 50 minutes, Joseph Stalin died. Wow, I need to, this is pretty interesting. So the newspapers, uh, polls. Oh yeah, I got to uh, put this into a special cover. That's pretty cool. Interestingly is that if you take a look, the frame is kind of like uh, somebody painted it with a pencil, interesting. Wow, amazing newspaper. <laughs> nice gift for my buddy. So, cool, cool. I will call him later and uh, tell him thanks for that. <laughs> now, we're gonna go back to the box here. Now, this is pretty cool, it's quite large. And what we're gonna do is, we're gonna open it up. So, let me see, okay. Photographs, documents, probably. Yes, yes, a lot of interesting stuff. Okay, let's see. Okay, another piece. <laughs> Looks like uh, the uh, paper from Burger King, you know, when we order our meal. <laughs> oh, here's something. Okay, I know what that is. Nope, nothing, that's it. Well, let's start okay let's start with this one uh, it's an award oh nice 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 so as you know I have a very big fetish uh, for uh, Soviet guards badges and especially the ones from the war so you can see the fringes are not uh, visible here so if you see the fringes here you can actually uh, identify them as a post-war piece. But you can check out my previous video uh, with more information about that. And I will attach the link right to the video so you can actually click on it. This is pretty interesting. <laughs> Looks like that's made. Um, unfortunately, this piece broke off, so it probably had it on the uniform like this, but very nice. Good. Well, that makes me already very happy. Go to the next one. Okay. A red star. Wow. The enamel is gone. But you can see it's a very nice piece. It's a nice number. See, it's 1,277,440. Uh, right? Yeah, 440. Nice, nice one. Definitely uh, worth to research it. So it's not a long, um, long service award. It's actually a wartime award. Nice one. A silver uh, screw, so I'm probably gonna use that. So nice piece, very nice piece. Just put it here. Let's go to the next one. Now this is also something pretty cool. Not often seen. Now these were made from a um, uh, roll, photo roll. So somebody of the office has made a photograph. And as you can see, it's actually, you can see it here, it's Akfa. So they were like making some pictures and you can see the uh, Zist truck, some officers looking at the map. 
That's a very interesting. Soldiers on a truck. Officer smokes a cigarette. There are female also on the truck, probably medics. And some city. Wow, that's interesting. Look at this. It's probably somewhere in Germany. That's definitely somewhere in Germany. So it's after the war. Interesting. And here we have a filled kitchen. You can see that. Uh, with uh, kids around it, next to it. That's pretty interesting. You can see here, Akfa. Very interesting timepiece. Unfortunately, I don't have the rest. Or the person who got it uh, sold it to me had just this one left so interesting i will also post uh, some pictures on my instagram very nice let's continue what we got here is okay that's interesting i'm just gonna put this away okay this is pretty interesting take a look at the officer and the kid and it says, uh, Vanya Sobolyov, uh, Sin uh, Palka, that means like a uh, son of the unit. So back in the days, it uh, was usually like this, that when a unit moved through a town, village, for example, sometimes they adopted a kid and made him the son of the unit. So basically he was uh, doing stuff such as, for example, uh, delivering messages, um, nothing big, but sometimes happens that some kids were actually involved also into battles and uh, they supported, for example, the field artillery. And there were several of them actually awarded with uh, um, high awards. So this is something very unique you don't see too often. Also, I will post this on my Insta. Nice one. What else do we have here? A hospital, a female doctor, some offices together. Very nice. Nothing on the back side. And here we have also several officers and a female service member. Very interesting. Unfortunately, the picture is very old, so it's kind of like if you see it's a little bit destroyed. Nothing on the back side. Okay, good. Let's continue to the next one. So I'm just gonna go with that one. That's a nice picture of a uh, service member of the Red Army. Probably. 30 something like that let me see yes yeah, 32 very interesting <laughs> very interesting i will not translate that i will just show it later on on my instagram so what else do we have here many other interesting photographs pretty cool again dove stuff mm. love this kind of pictures with female soldiers on them what else uh, it's prague her name is yeah, Czechoslovakia, the name of the female soldier and uh, uh, the guy probably. Very interesting. That's a female pilot or something like that. Also very old photograph. And yeah, I will also translate it and post it. Pretty cool. What else do we have here? Family photograph. <laughs> the sun has even the what is that one of the medals pretty cool some information wait that's american style right that's american style of uh writing a date pretty interesting i will also translate it later on and this is war <laughs> leningrad leningrad medal and on the back side it says uh, 12th June 1943 to Leonid from Zina, don't forget me, something like that. That's pretty interesting. Love those kind of old photographs. Very interesting. Next one, some service member. 1946, interesting. Uh, uh, yeah, and keepsake. To my friend uh, during um, our service in Germany and the RKK in the Soviet Army or Red Army. Pretty interesting. So I always remember 1941. Nice. Beautiful. Very beautiful. Next one is this one. Pretty interesting photograph. 
This is actually to my battle buddies, the names of them. And uh, April 45, Order, the River Order. And it says here, Razvechiki, so Scout. Very interesting, very, very interesting piece. Very interesting. It's also worth to try to research those guys. Also another very interesting photograph here is, um, this is like beginning of the war. Um, yeah, see it's uh, uh, 29th of June 41. So right after the war started, it's written in Ukrainian, but yeah, it's very not, it's not grammatically correct written, but still it's from father to his daughter. That's very interesting. <laughs> interesting if this guy actually survived the war, whoever one of those four guys now let's take a look at this piece oh lovely this is actually an uh, ID to the base in East Germany uh, given to Sergei Nikolaevich uh, Grab yeah Grab 92 so and he still served in East Germany very interesting and this is pretty awesome we're awarded to soldiers by saying thank you for uh, taking a city or liberating a city and this one is actually very interesting because it's for the second ukrainian front from 19 uh, from march 26 1944 and it's an appreciation document for a pretty interesting document it's for the same person and this one is actually also giving uh Operation Second Front, okay, 22nd uh, August, 24th August, and the city Yassi and Kishinev, very big operations. Actually, my grandpa took part of them, you know, and uh, I'm, okay, let's open up this one. This is well packed. Gee, okay, very well packed. Some IDs, oh, love IDs. Okay, this is a classification for a cinematographist. Yeah, that's very interesting. From 1960. Uh, this one is actually uh, what is it? like. Uh, ah, okay, that's interesting. So geography, history, and etc. And marks very nice and uh, qualification ID for a motorist interesting all for one person so that's actually it this I hope you all enjoyed that I wish you all a nice weekend and looking forward to see your comments more likes and subscribe to my channel and again have a nice one thank you all bye bye